Welcome back, everybody. This your girl, Heavy Sin. I want to thank all my subscribers. I truly appreciate y'all. Okay, so this is going to be your bonus read for the weekend, all right? Remember, this read is general, and it's not going to resonate with everybody, all right? Let me tap right in. Now, the main energy, all right, for the weekend this is dealing with two different people, but kind of similar in a way, okay? Like, one person may be more cool, calm, collective, like, laid back type shit, and the other person could be more... Stuck in they fucking ways. But it's more of... It's an energy of like... Bow down to me type shit. But it's like, okay... The other person, it's like... I run shit. I don't know. You... The only thing you running is your goddamn mouth. You see what I'm saying? So it's like two different people... But it's like kind of the same energy, but it's one is more, it's really like, this ain't back in the day. You see what I'm saying? It's like that, okay? Like you gonna have to, it's a feeling like, okay, let me check this motherfucker because this ain't how shit was going okay you may was dealing with some shit back in your days but the times have changed you see what i'm saying if that shit just made sense so this is dealing with these two people okay now somebody is trying to offer something and i feel like this is dealing with both people like somebody is offering Somebody is trying to come back, okay, where boundaries already been set up, okay, they already been set up, this cycle is over with whoever trying to offer something, this is, this is, it's like these two energies, these two people is going through the same thing, okay, so this is somebody trying to come back around, offer something, but the cycle already been wrapped up. Like, boundaries already been set up. And it's kind of like opposing energy, okay? It's like haters. It's like, okay, trying to challenge something. Trying to fight for somebody, like, loyalty or a affection or commitment because this is serious energy this motherfuckers is trying to come towards you see what i'm saying but i feel like it's this person who trying to come towards somebody okay it's it's because something is is going a person way like things is finally turning around for somebody Okay. And it's like they very confident in it. Like they really putting they all in it. Like they really focus on this. Okay. But you got some type of offer. Okay. That had potential. But it's like. Okay. That's over with. It's over with. Now. The energy that's cool, calm, and collective, all right? Not the energy where it's this how it should be and this the way it, you you need to go about a book like that. Not that. The cool, calm, and collective person. It's going to be... Some type of life changing experience that you finna go through. Now this may not have happened yet. But it's gonna come. 
Because whoever coming towards you is really taking their time. This is that same energy where it's my way or the highway. You know what I'm saying? Like, you have to dress a certain way or you have to speak in a certain tone. This the energy that's coming towards you. Okay. They may want a serious commitment. They want to come together. Okay. But it's like this opposing energy. It's like some type of energy is trying to stop them from coming to you. Okay. It's energy opposing challenging that's why they going through this and you going through this you got energy that's coming towards you trying to oppose something okay but it's like you straight ignoring it because it's like that's over with like why the fuck are you calling me it's like that this person who coming towards you is going through the same shit where it's like trying to stop this person from coming towards you trying to but it's like, once again, it ain't really phasing them. It's like because they focused on going towards you, like, you the focus. It's like, I'm taking action towards that. Like, I want a serious commitment with that. Like, this person may have played a lot of mind games. Okay, it could have been just a lot of manipulation. This person could have been lying to themselves dealing with this situation with you, okay? It took a lot of patience and time for this person to really recognize a role that they have played in your life type shit. Like, they really had to go within to really see... What type of energy they was throwing your way because it wasn't nothing but manipulation. It was like, what's up with the games? What's up with the games? This person is wiser now. This person has evolved, okay? Because they had to really... You made this person, like... You mirrored this person ways. And they was faced with it. Like, they they really had to go within and really fix, on, fix that shit. Because it took a lot of patience and time to work on themselves dealing with that area. And I feel like it's definitely going to be a, a new emotional beginning with this person. With this person. Because it was a lot of just sadness around it. It was. Like. Like somebody could have been naive. You know what I'm saying? Like just. The thought of. Love. And being in love. And. And. And really wanting a serious commitment with this person. It, it just was like disappointing. Because this person had you waiting. And waiting. And waiting. And it was like. You were single and free and independent. You could have did whatever the fuck you wanted to do. But you, you chose to wait. But you really didn't need this person. Like you really don't need this person. And it's like a new emotional beginning. Dealing with this. It's going to be a new emotional beginning. Let me get right into this reading because damn, that was a long as main energy. You see what I'm saying? Like, I don't, what the fuck? I'm this, I'm nine minutes in this bitch. Now, let me jump right in because this is all around mad games, manipulation, backstabbing. I feel like that really ain't do nothing but left a person confused. And I feel like they know that. Like, okay, a person just doing something just to be doing it because that's what it is. Like, you may have asked a question and this person just say the first thing that come to their motherfucking mind type shit. And it was like, okay, what? 
it left a person confused, right? It's like, okay, this shit is stupid. That's what this is. And I feel like that's over with. It's over with, okay? Like, somebody really need to nourish and grow, okay? Especially they soul. You know what I'm saying? Because all these goddamn mind games, it's like, look, you need to nourish and grow your goddamn mind. You see what I'm saying? If that shit just made sense. Because it's like, this. that's over with. This That cycle is wrapped the fuck up dealing with the mind games, okay? It's over with. Like... Somebody really want to get serious. They really do. Like, they really want to move forward. Because it was a feeling of a separation. You know what I'm saying? Even though it was like somebody really had a lot of passion for a person. It was just like... A lot of emotions, like, up and down. But you were still strong. It, you still show strength no matter what. Like, I feel like you still stood up for yourself through the feeling of being left out. Like, you still stay strong within this. And it was a lot of bravery with this. A lot of bravery because it was just too many mind games. It's like, when do it end? You see what I'm saying? If this is making sense, because this is all coming from a new day. Like, something happened where it's like, you know what? I can't live in in a, in, I can't live for yesterday. (laughs) Like, I got to live for today. Like, that's where this is coming from. And it's like the situation dealing with that, it's like, okay, freedom. You know what I'm saying? Being happy. Like somebody was happy, free, like just somebody was genuinely loving a person. Okay? Offering love, support. Like somebody could have been like really secretly happy. But more was playing mind games, if that shit is making sense. And I feel like right now, they want to get serious. They want to get serious because this ain't this shit, but confuse the situation. It's like, okay, is you happy or is you not? You know what I'm saying? Because somebody could be feeling like a fool like damn i feel like a fool in this shit like well damn is a motherfucker juggling me and somebody else it's like that confusion but somebody could be just really trying to just go by faith and just 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 walk with it just take it one day at a time type shit you know what i'm saying dealing with it because it was a lot of confusion it was a lot of confusion and the mad games had motherfuckers confused and it was like, damn, how you happy as fuck, slow key, like somebody just did not want to express that they was happy low key, like, you know what, you do make me happy, like, let me stop motherfucking playing these games, like, yes, I love you type shit. It was more like, let me be low key with my love. Don't want nobody else to have this person, but I don't want this person to, to think that they got me like that. Like, they got me wrapped around their finger type shit. You know what I'm saying? So, it's like, okay, let me play man games. Like, come the fuck on. You gonna fuck up some shit playing them goddamn man games, and then motherfuckers gonna be mad as hell when they see the next motherfucker walking with the person who they supposed to be with, but they were so busy playing man games that they fuck around and lost them because ain't nobody got time to be figuring out no goddamn puzzles and and, and fucking crossroads and 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 fucking jeopardy around this bitch you see what i'm saying if that shit just made sense now what's sitting on the foundation okay is like 
stalker. You watching. Okay. It's like, how you playing mind games and you stalking and shit at the same time? Pull up on a motherfucker and they doing the same shit that they've been doing. Ain't shit fucking changed, but you want to watch and you want to play games to see what the fuck is going to happen. Like, come on the fuck off. Then you got somebody feeling stuck or somebody needed to... Some, this person looking at it different. They looking at it different. It's like, you know what? Let me Let me just go with this. Let me take a risk on this. Because it, I'm wiser now and, and I'm done with the mind games type shit. Because what else is on this foundation? Like, it was a third party situation, but it's like now it's, it's really you and this person type shit. Because somewhere somebody is really defending, trying to fight for this, this long term. This commitment. They really trying to fight for it. They they didn't put up a long battle to get this. But it, it's the mind games that would, would create the friction. If that is making sense. Like you play mind games with a motherfucker who is direct and honest. What the fuck you expect? Some shit finna blow the fuck up. Because this person who is direct and honest... It's like, okay, look, I ain't got time to be trying to figure out what's on your mind. You know what I'm saying? Let me know. Speak the fuck up instead of just playing these mind games and shit. Like, that shit's stupid. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers want to see action around this bitch. It's like, stay focused, okay? Because somebody could be getting distracted. Okay, stay focused. Something with distraction. Because it's like, somebody looking at the situation, like, okay, very confident in it. Somebody is very confident in the situation. But it's just, somebody is just secretly happy, though. That's the whole thing, and it's... It's kind of fucked up because when a person don't express how they feel and it's like you sitting there trying to guess, like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, ain't nobody got time to be playing no guessing fucking game. It's like an energy round, like, been through a lot. Somebody been through a lot. Like, some real dark days type shit. Like, a lot of trials and tribulations that really taught them hardcore lessons type shit. Like, somebody really been at the bottom. They really have. Somebody could be fearing detachment. Like, fearing they ended up alone or ended up, like, a motherfucker just really give up on this shit. You know what I'm saying? But this is leading to a transformation. A new beginning. Because something had to end dealing with the mind games and shit for something to really start over fresh. This is definitely dealing with a person two energies once again who is it's like masculine and feminine. The offer is still here on this table. This, this, it's like somebody finna offer somebody this long-term commitment. But whoever getting the offer is like very confident, very stable, very like, it's a feeling like, what more can you want in a, in a, female type shit that's the energy this person is carrying it's like confidence and, and you know what i'm saying putting like going taking action taking lead type shit and then but you also got a person who know how to handle business so this is definitely something that was from like a past life that's really like continuing from this one 
It's like continuing in this life. So, two people is really coming back together. They're really coming back together because in the past life, they could have been kids. And it's like, this life, they fucking adults. And it's like, they just continuing it. If that is making sense. Because I feel like this is all leading to somebody change the way they think. Like, it's a lot of growth with the way they think, with the way they communicate. That's going to change. Okay. The offer is still there. The offer is still going to be there. But it's up to you. You have free will to choose whether you want this offer or not. Because it's like, okay, you could be thinking about this, this, these mad games and manipulation and deception and deceiving and lying and cheating and whatever it was. Like, you just can't erase that. You know what I'm saying? It's that still happened. So that's why this this free will is here. Even though the offer's still on the table. It's like you have a choice to either pick that motherfucker up or just walk past that bitch. You see what I'm saying? So yeah, that's really all I got, y'all. So I feel like somebody ready to be serious. Like, I mean serious. And it's up to you if you want the offer or not. So, yeah, that's what I got. So, thumbs the fuck up if that shit just made sense. If you like the tip heaven, I truly appreciate y'all. Send from heaven, 225 at gmail.com at the PayPal. You already know. Peace out, y'all.